You smell good. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Dargo. Our fur baby's getting in the video. Hello, everyone. So this tag is old. Everyone's done it, except for me, which is why I want to do it. But there's one problem. I don't have a boyfriend. I have a husband. You're abnormal. <laughs> So I just figured, whatever, I will do the boyfriend tag and just change it to the husband tag because the questions are still relevant. By the way, uh, we, I will be posting this video on our fifth wedding anniversary. So yay, that, I just thought it'd be fun to do for our fifth wedding anniversary. One more thing to help me not forget it. Yep. All right, so you ready for the questions? Yes. Where did we meet? Uh, we, we met on a high school chorale trip to Disneyland. Well, Disney World, actually. Yeah, but Ka Disney yeah, Disney. Caleb doesn't really understand the difference. But yeah, no, it was a, it was a band and chorus trip, and both of us were in uh, two different choral groups for our high school. So technically, that's when we first met, even though I already knew who he was because I knew his girlfriend at the time. So, but yes, that's actually how we officially met, though. We met on the bus. Everyone kept talking about the weird guy in the choral group, so naturally I had to make sure I sat next to him to find out what his story was, and I didn't find him all that weird. But then again, people think I'm weird, so we're a very well-made match. Yes, indeed. Where was our first date? Yeah, I know. That one I'm not even sure. I, 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 I had to think about that one for a while. But you know, I, I thought about it, and I think technically our first date was one of uh, James's parties in his room. Remember, we were playing games. A bunch of people sitting on, around yeah. in the room playing video games. <laughs> and I was the only girl in at the party for like the first two hours, so it was a little awkward, but uh, yeah, technically that was the first place we went to together after we officially started being boyfriend girlfriend. I, 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 what was your first impression of me? Why is she so interesting? <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I honestly think that was it. I, oh I, really? Yeah. Oh, that's Be, nice. People don't normally put that much effort into you know getting to know somebody off the bat and sort of putting themselves. I don't want to say in their way, you know, but but pretty much that. Yeah. In, in terms of, I want to talk to you. I want to know to you. I want to ask you questions. When did you meet the family? That's kind of a dumb question. <laughs> Long before any of the other things we just exactly made. yeah because uh, he lived down the street from me he he could just walk to my house if he wanted to so we were over at each other's house all times. the time yeah you did how long have we been together we entered this little party just last weekend and I, yeah I know and you forgot already I, didn't you I did it's something like ten or eleven years yeah oh yeah hey you got it <laughs> <laughs> um. one of those two. <laughs> So of course, I already said we've been married for five years, but yeah, um, the following week after our wedding anniversary, we will have officially been together for 11, 11 years. So yeah, you were you were on it. You got well, it. See? By no, by no virtue of my own. Well, don't think so hard about it. That's what screws you in the end. You think too hard about it. Do you have a tradition with uh, your wife? <sighs> whole bunch. You used to not have any and I, I changed that. <laughs> I, I mean probably the biggest one and I think you've got videos to prove it is the, the trip to Myrtle Beach. Mm -hmm. Been doing that basically since the first first week we, or first year we met. Yes we have a lot of holiday traditions uh, that he gets involved in especially since I'm, I'm pagan he likes to help out with cooking and nothing fancy just well, yeah, holiday stuff. Holiday decorations. Oh stuff. holiday decorations yeah. I mean, what about daily traditions, though? I mean, we walk the dog every day, of course. Yeah. I, I don't know if that's really a tradition. Nighttime snuggles? Nighttime snuggles. Mm, nighttime snuggles. I, I'd imagine all those are fairly common. That's true. What was our first road trip? Well, I think we already answered that question. Yeah, Myrtle Beach, definitely. What was the first thing you noticed about me? So you had first impression, now what was the first thing you noticed? Well, I guess I'll throw in you, you, were, you were certainly touchier than your average high school girl. Which is so weird for me because I don't really like being touched, but for whatever reason, he did not bother me. Hint. Foreshadowing. Mm -hmm. um, what is my favorite restaurant? You know, I used to have one and then I met you. <laughs> 
<laughs> he makes me go to all these uh, different places I would never have considered trying before. So that's why it's a difficult well, question. But right now, I mean, there we was both- Tia's before that and then closed. Tia's, yeah, we were at Tia's all the time when we were teenagers, yeah. Uh, but um, I guess right now, Pasta Plus is definitely up there for us. What do we argue about the most? That's pretty easy. I mean, everybody. Uh, I mean, I guess a little bit money. A little bit. I'd say that's probably our number one thing, but that's most couples. Yeah, I was gonna say, I, I'd say chore stuff. Oh yeah, we do argue about that a lot. Yeah. He tends to make bigger messes with certain things, and that just drives me crazy, because I don't make as big of a mess when I do the same thing. So then I get irritated helping him clean it up when if I'd done it, it would have been less messy. There are also messes Kelsey is comfortable with leaving for weeks at a time. Like, like makeup? Is no, that what you're talking about? No, I'm, I'm talking like kitchen table and stuff like that. But that's you too. That's not just me. Agreed. Yeah. Who wears the pants in the relationship? Oh, probably. But but I, you, I, no, you swap back and forth. Yeah, and I hate that question too because it's, it just comes off as a very sexist question to me. She cares a lot more about most things. I do, that's true, I do. But at the same time, like I, I'll take what I heard somebody else say. A relationship is happy when nobody is wearing pants. <laughs> robes for that. Or nice. robes. Yeah, just robes. Like smoking yeah. jackets. Smoking jackets. Ooh, we should get you one. <laughs> Uh, that'll add in my list of horribly impractical Christmas gifts. Yay! Um, if I'm watching TV, what am I watching? I mean, ne Netflix is a given. Well, yeah, but what on Netflix? I mean, although that changes all the time. I mean, when, when you're cross-stitching reruns. Yeah. Yeah, right now I'm watching Gotham, but you knew that, didn't you? No. Oh, it's actually like really good. What is one food I do not like? <laughs> I hate peas. What drink do I order when we go out to eat? That's an interesting question. Mostly wine. Yeah. That's true. Maybe. Yeah. And, and you know that that's whatever the house has. And you're you're usually a red drinker. So usually, um, it, sometimes I I decide on white. What size shoe do I wear? Oh, Lord, no, I don't know. Size yeah. small. Size small. I do have tiny feet. What is my favorite kind of sandwich? I know, I don't really eat sandwiches. Oh, oh hey, good yeah, job. Don't have to yeah, no, that's true. But not with American cheese, though. She's I want real cheese. Southern. Mac and cheese, grilled cheese, and anything real fried cheese. involving cheese. It has to be real cheese. That I can't stand all that fake shit. It's nasty, and it's frankly lazy. Use real cheese. What is one talent that I have? We're gonna do something obvious. <laughs> yes, actually, I can. I can crack the cartilage in my ears. I'm not even gonna try showing you though, because I'd have to get really close to the camera. What would I eat every day if I could? Cheese. <laughs> then she does. And I do. <laughs> <laughs> I do. Like, at the end of the day, I realize I haven't had cheese, I go looking for cheese. <laughs> some people will go for whole grains, some people go for grams of protein. She goes for ounces. I do. What is my favorite music? Oh boy. Yeah, uh, that's a I mean, big I'll, question. I'll go, I'll go with the, the new age. I mean, you always come back to it eventually. You know, that's true. New age was my first love. When I was uh, seven years old, that's when I got into it. I loved it before yeah, anything it's else. It's funny because, you know, I'm not sure. Even if, if even if they came out with music like it in these days, whether people would still call it new age. Yeah, they, they've been... broken it up more now, but I guess when it started, they just kind of lumped it all into new age, and now it's got a bunch of subcategories, kind of like goth. Partly because because it consists of individual people who are trying very hard to be different than all the other individual people. Good thoughts. <laughs> what is my favorite sports team? I guess we'll go with Baltimore Ravens. What else do I watch? No, fair enough. <laughs> you said we need to get into hockey. I do actually. I kind of want to get into hockey. What is my eye color? Uh, gray blue with a little, little tiny bit of brown around the middles. I knew he'd get that one. He's always talking about how he loves my eye color. What is something you do that I wish you didn't? Oh, that list goes on forever. <laughs> well, we'll go with one you mentioned earlier, and then that's just uh, not use so many dishes when you're cooking. Yes, I do hate that, but actually, I was thinking he was going to pick that he leaves papers everywhere. Ah, yeah, I do hate filing. Where am I from? Um, 
five minutes down the road from where I'm from. <laughs> Pretty much. What kind of cake would you bake me on my birthday? Hmm. He only just started getting into baking. He used to be very anti-baking. I mean, I, I don't know if it counts as a cake or a baking. But tiramisu or cheesecake oh. would be a too, too good choice. Tiramisu is a good choice. What can I spend hours doing? Cross-stitching. Yep. I, I, I think you were expecting that one. I was, actually. Mm. If I could live anywhere, where would it be? England. You think? You see, the thing is, I haven't really thought about that, especially because I am okay with living here. Yeah, I guess I, if I could live in England for a year, that would be nice. All right, so I did the husband tag, which was the boyfriend tag, but I made it the husband tag. So you're not <laughs> getting any boyfriends anytime soon? No, I haven't had a boyfriend for five years now. I've had a husband. But I hope you all enjoyed it, and I will uh, see you all next time. Bye.